Hey YouTube friends and family. How's everybody doing? I wanted to get back on here and give you a holler. Trucker's site has been hijacked. That's right, you've heard me right. The truckers shutting down America. The strike that they have planned for October 11th through October 13th. The site on Facebook has been shut down. I have no clue exactly why. There's a lot of stories going around. You know the rumor mill. You know the drill, the way that it goes. But they're trying to shut them down. Now you might ask yourself if this speaks volumes as to why this needs to be done. Facebook shut the door on 86,000 plus when they shut that site down. That's 86,000 plus people that were on that site backing the truckers, backing us, backing the American people because things aren't right. When they can go in and with one little click, shut that down, just like a lot of channels here on YouTube. Just because they decide to, we've got a problem. We certainly do. And for the people that cannot see that, I feel sorry for you. Rumor has it that it was shut down because somebody mentioned God. Is that why they're trying to shut down our Constitution? Shut down the liberty here in the United States of America? In America? You know, I have no squawks with anybody that doesn't believe in God. I have no squawks with anybody that believes in a different God. I have no squawks with anybody that believes in God. We each have the right to have our own beliefs. So, if that was the case, that it was shut down because of the word God, or that somebody said, God bless us all, quite frankly, we need blessings, my friends. We certainly do. Things are amok. We're hitting potholes everywhere. The old trucks are bouncing and ducking and dodging them right along with your four-wheelers. Yes. Systems upside down. Well, I'm going to put a link down below because you can't tie a trucker down. You certainly can't. You're not going to stop them wheels from turning. Not unless the trucker wants it to stop. So I'm going to give you the link. And I want to thank RideForTheConstitution.org for bringing the truckers in. I also got an email saying that Canada truckers are back in the American truckers. I hope that's true. I'll be looking and checking to find out if it is. But in, in the meantime, my friends, please go to the site that I share here in the show more below. Support the truckers. Because in supporting the truckers, you're supporting yourselves and your families. This is something that needs to be done. Give it some thought. This action is a peaceful action. You don't have to get out and march on the streets and risk the being sprayed, pepper sprayed, kicked around, beat up, thrown in jail to voice your disdain for the conditions in America today. All you have to do is follow the trucker's lead, walk through that door,
and do not go to work on the 11th, 12th, and 13th of October. Do not buy anything. Do not spend one. Well, I was going to say copper penny, but doggone it, I don't even think they're copper anymore. Don't spend a cent. Close the checkbook. You know, you write the checks. You're the one that's supporting those golf games and those trips, those vacations, the second homes, third homes, the mortgages, the new shoes, the fancy offices. Yeah, you're the one that's supporting them. So I'm asking you right now to show your support. It's for your own good. Facebook trucker site hijacked. The listeners. Yeah. Well, guys, I'm over and out for now. But I'll be back. And I'd like to see more support. Get out here and make your own videos. If you believe. If you care. If you are fed up like the rest of us, make a video. I'd like to thank each and every one of you. Love you bunches and great big hugs. And we'll catch you on the flip-flop.